So did he accept the divorce at first, like really well, and then it kind of shifted? I think we went off and on. You know, we went about eight months without even speaking to each other at the beginning of the divorce. For Kim Kardashian, it seems silence is golden, at least when it comes to her ongoing divorce from Kanye West. And then, you know, we started talking again and I went to the Dondra premiere. I mean, he would still see the kids and stuff. It's just that, you know, him and I just took a minute of not talking. And I think it all, in relationships, it'll, it'll be like that. You just gotta roll with it. And during the latest episode of Dear Media's Not Skinny But Not Fat podcast, the 41-year-old reality star also opens up about the rapper's social media rants against her. Remember this one? Most men do not, there's no such thing as 50-50 custody with, with, in society today. That's not, that's not even, it always leans towards the mom. But for Kim, she says she approached all that with compassion. It doesn't mean that maybe because he expressed himself in a certain way that he's not an amazing person, an amazing friend. I do believe that we'll have that again. I'm always really hopeful and, you know, he's an amazing dad and, and I never really also judge the way someone wants to communicate, whether it's the way I would or not. I try to just like, I know who he is inside. And now it seems Kanye is trying to get to a better place with Kim for the sake of their kids. Last month, ET learned the Grammy winner told the beauty mogul he's going to get help and has agreed to stop harassing her and cyberbullying her current boyfriend, Pete Davidson. You'll recall Kanye rapped about the SNL star in his latest single, Easy. God sent me from that crash just so I could beat Pete Davidson's ass. Our source says for the sake of Kim and Kanye's four little ones, North, Saint, Chicago, and Psalm, Ye told Kim he's not making any public appearances or inflammatory social media statements, and he will go away somewhere to get better. Just do something for my heart. A rep for Ye tells ET, quote, at this time, Ye is committed to a healthy co-parenting relationship with Kim and is focused on raising their beautiful children. And the Skims founder is positive they will reach that place. You know, I look back and my mom and dad went through their hard time and it took people a minute to readjust. Mm. And I've seen it all before. I think we just have a different kind of platform now. Mm. I hope we are the co-parenting goals at yeah. the end of the day. It's a sentiment Kim's sister Chloe echoed to ET back in 2019. I think everyone has to handle their co-parenting situation in their own style, but my mom and my dad were like that. It took them years, but my dad would come over once a week for family dinners and would play golf with my stepdad. And so we come from a family where we believe in that and you share children with people and that's how it should be. It's a beautiful thing to get along with each other and for your kids to see that. For now, it seems Kim is focused on the future, including her blossoming romance with Pete. I like you just the way you are. Now, are you going to kiss me or not? I sure am, Jasmine. And that moment that sparked it all is something we'll see more of on the family's new reality series on Hulu. What do you love about him? What's your favorite thing about him? He's just super genuine, yeah. and it's just really fun to just hang out and do nothing and watch TV and just do nothing. <laughs> That's my favorite thing. That's the goal, is yeah. finding someone to do nothing with. It's yeah. the best.